Hi, I'm Rich with Inside HPC. We're at the Intel booth at ISC 13 in Leipzig, Germany. And uh, we're going to get a little bit of a demo run here. And this is all about multi-physics. So we'll start with you, Ulrich. What, what are you showing here at the booth? Actually, we're showing here an application running on a very typical workstation. But behind the workstation, you see a desk site cluster that is doing all the computation. So this demo shows actually how an engineer that is used to a workstation environment and runs an application on that, that Windows-based workstation can use high-performance computing technology and this small desk site cluster here, this one is from Fujitsu here, uh, to enhance his capabilities. So he can do much more, much faster, more variance, and that kind of stuff. So, so it's a Windows environment, so he doesn't have to be like a Beowulf clustering expert to do this kind of work? Right, right. The, the workstation itself stays on Windows, but the cluster, of course, is running on Linux. And he doesn't see the cluster at all because the application has it built in that the compute demand is shifted to the cluster and it's used as a server, this client server model. Yeah? This both is intercluster ready certified, so the cluster is certified as intercluster ready, makes it extremely easy to operate such a cluster and to, to uh, define the right cluster size for that application. The application itself, it's COMSOL, multi physics in this case, is registered for intercluster ready, so that means. This application will run on each and every intercluster ready certified solution. So can you explain the concept of multi-physics to me? I mean, I, I kind of think I know what it means, but uh, what are you talking about? Uh, actually, I would like to hand over then to my colleague, oh, okay. who can talk about uh, the application itself. Okay, yeah, great, great. So, so, so what are we seeing here as far as multi-physics? Yeah, so uh, with this application you can simulate different uh, physics uh, applications like electromagnetics, structural mechanics and so forth. But the idea of multi-physics is not only having different applications but to also couple all those applications to get the real picture of uh, this uh, virtual prototype that we have here. What you can see on the screen for example is um, the model of a patch antenna. So we first got the geometry, then we set up the whole physics and then we later on so we have uh, perfectly for example electric conductors here and then you can uh, make a sweep uh, over different parameters for example to get the optimum out of the device so this is what is done here we are doing device optimization and design optimization and uh, you had a so, so, so when you bring those together, that becomes much more computationally intensive, does it not? Exactly. The matrices got, get more dense, so you are doing uh, really heavy numerics, and uh, dependent on the size of your model and the complexity of your coupling, you have to go to bigger machines, and, uh, well, if it gets bigger and bigger, you might also need to go to a cluster environment. So <clears throat> with this uh, way, we can make it simpler for the design engineer and also for the researcher that is maybe not used to go on a cluster. So they have a very small step to go on a cluster environment. How, how, how will this change the way they do their work, their workflow? Yeah, it will uh, enable them to go for completely different uh, uh, kinds of models, for bigger models, for, uh, for uh, going away from uh, pure research to also controlling your design. So you're really um, substituting your prototype by virtual prototype and you can yeah, try to control also the whole design and production process.